Hey YouTube, it's Alicia here, and I am coming to do a makeup tutorial. Um, maybe tomorrow I'll do another one just for you can see my hair color. I'm going back to the hairdresser. But um, before I get started pretty good, I want to tell you um, um, the foundation I'm using is the L'Oreal Foundation, and it is the L'Oreal Foundation Infallible Long Wearing Stick Foundation in Chestnut 411. And then I'm um, in the concealer, it's 395, and it's the full, full wearing um, in 395, and that is Walnut. So, um, like I'm saying, this is a a Shira inspired. Oh, today it wouldn't be a Shira inspired. Look, this is a He-Man, Masters of the Universe, and we're going to be using two palettes. We're going to be using this palette first. So, the first thing is I'm going to take, I'm going to take this brush, and let me see, and we're just going to take this color here. So, excuse me if you see me looking down, and we're just going to put that in the crease. And I'm just starting this at my base. Okay. And then we're going to not that brush. We're gonna take this brush. And just go over it a little and so then we're going to take this brush let me see we're going to take this color here this color orange right here and we're going to put that in the crease as and stuff and what we're going to do we're going to take this brush again and we're going to blend it and the reason I'm doing this I'm doing a He-Man inspired um, makeup look inspired by the sorceress and I'm going going off the base of not the 2002 but I'm going based off of the 2000 and um, um I'm going to say not off the 2002, but the original version and stuff. Because, like I said, when I do these, I give you some... Oh, excuse me. Oh. I do a little bit of... I do a... Ooh. Excuse me, y'all. Um, let me see. <sighs> Clear that up, clean that up uh, a little bit. Might end up, end up being a cute mistake. Let's just put it that way. And stuff, but. The next color we're going to use, where is that brush? Here it is. <laughs> we're going to be using a blue. And we have mostly of a shimmer. All right. I think we're going to go with this. Um, let me show you the color. We're gonna go with this color at the top, and we're gonna put it in the right out here. So I'm gonna have to look down 
a bit and and let me just tell y'all a little bit about the sorcerers okay the sorceress is the sorceress of Castle Grayskull And, you know, like I'm saying, she's the um, sorceress of Castle Grayskull. And uh, what I like about her is um, she's like the protector of Castle Grayskull. Um, I grew up to these um, series and stuff like that. And um, I'm pulling the orange and the blue. and thing right here because this is just my um i have a totally different way of doing makeup it's like just something different and i'm actually am liking what i'm it, how it's turning out and stuff so you know it's like Turned out pretty good. We're just gonna blend this a little in a little bit. Alright. So um before I go, let me go on with this brush right here. And we're just gonna pick up the highlight color right quick before I go. To my next palette, I mean, all right, I'm actually like in. So that was um, this palette right here. So the next palette I am going to be using will be the tropical palette and out of the tropical palette it's by don't do a um the do a color and these are the colors right here and we're going to be using paradise city right here um just to finish it out and stuff so that's the last color we are using and we're just using Paradise City as the white. So for the sources. And there is the eyes. So. Like I'm saying, it was just, this part was just a simple part. So we're going to finish it off. So first and foremost, we are going to finish it with my powder. And thing that is turning out pretty well. So we're going to use this brush. And we're going to use the CoverGirl Queen Collection. And this is in Q4, Q425 medium deep this is that and let me get to see what it's looking like so this is the color and thing but yeah but um um let me just get back on the sources with her she's the aid for he man and then um when he needs to go to etheria to help his um sister or go see his sister Mostly in some of the episodes, or Hordak uh, will transport him into Etheria, or or let me see what I'm thinking. What's the word I'm looking for? Okay, so there we have that. 
that. So we're going to go on and move on. Move some stuff around. And we're going to use the blush. So you don't hardly see no blush on her. So I'm going to have to use one of my favorite blushes. And yeah, and it's called Poppy. And it's by LA Colors Raid Rouge. Um, and it's called Poppy. Well, I've been using this mostly in um Okay. So we're gonna do a little different. Um she don't have a highlight, but I'm gonna create a highlight just for her and then this is from my juvia's place um eyeshadow palette and i'm going to be using this middle if you shade color right here just for my skin tone and we're just going to just as a highlight and stuff and it's turning out very beautiful and we just what we're going to do is we're just going to add it on the tip of the nose and try to there we go and what we're going to do with that we're going to take this and pull it just going to pull it and then we're going to Clean it up. All right. Then the next thing we're going to do is we're going to be using the Easy Breezy um, CoverGirls Easy Breezy Brow Pencil. Excuse me, y'all. The uh, nose part did not completely. There. There we go. So we're going to be using the Easy Breezy CoverGirl Brow Tint. This is some. This is just some of the things I I use and stuff. And this is some stuff I love using. I use yeah. So let me just give you a more a little insight on her. Like I'm saying, yeah, she is um. Da, da, da. Okay, and we're ready for our lips and um thing. Um, and the color I'm going to use, but before I finish, get through, um, let me just give you a little bit, like I'm, I was trying, I'm trying to do, give you a little bit on the sorceress. So the sorceress be, um, came the sorceress due to Kodak Ungo. And if you have, if you have not seen the original series, go and watch the original series from the 1980, um, 1980, I think it's the, I think it's the 84 or 85 version. It's two of them, and it's two complete seasons. And you go and watch it, and it's on that first, on the first um season where she comes into play, and she has to come and help with this um guy and thing. And she was, it was this character by the name of Kodak Ungol, and she was coming into her end of her reign as the sorceress of um Castle Grayskull. And she goes, but wait, she like tells her, tell if you come in, you never, you will never be the same again. And after that, she was never the same. Um, the sorceress real name was Tila Na. I am so obsessed with that name. Tila Na. That's her, that was her original name. And she never was called Tila Na ever again due to her becoming the sorceress. And once she became the sorceress, that was just something you see, you see through the series, and like she will aid them with in the um, in the He-Man um, series, uh, trying to help them, gives them a little insight what's going on, who's doing what. But like I'm saying, I love this was a fem another female character from the He-Man series that is a great is a very good key to this series, and it's a lot of um. Uh, characters you would get to meet, but she comes in. She comes in play very often and everything. And then when she has to get saved by by them and stuff. But the one thing what would you would not know, I will try to have to come back and do her daughters 
to her daughter. Now, you wouldn't know if from the series, Tila, um, the sorceress daughter is Tila, the captain of the guard. So I'll come back at a later date to her makeup tutorial and give you full insight on that. So let's put the lipstick on. The color I am using is called Glamour and it is by um, Broadway Colors Extender Lip Gloss. So I think this is going to be pretty, um, especially for women of color. I'm just going to have to keep doing this just to darken it a little. Now, I'm finna get ready to do this a little backwards. And think. All right, I have to take that back. Um, where are they? Oh, yeah, I've got to move some stuff around. Been um, straightening up and cleaning up today but yeah so we're going to be doing this a little bit backwards and we're going to take this lip liner by wet and wild it's a gel lip liner and it's called bear to comment that's the name of it and um, i'm going to just line my lip a little bit And there we go. This is my, um, and before I get through, I am going to take a little bit and just spray it a little bit. And the spray that I used was the Maybelline Master, um, Master Fix by Face Studios. And it is the translucent one. So, yes, this is the look. I think for me doing um and trying to just pick out my hair a little bit. But um let me know for tomorrow what kind of I will try to, you know, um every week try to get you one or the other one Shira or He Man Masters of the Universe makeup tutorial. And if you know what another makeup tutorial you will love to see, let me see it. I think for me just trying to do the sorceress. I think I actually pretty well did it. Put bringing in the orange, the blue. You have white, a pretty shimmery white, beautiful neutral eye um lip. I just think it's very beautiful. And tell me, if when you was growing up, if you grew, did you grow up to the Masters of the Universe? He man, he man, Masters of the Universe. If so. What was your favorite character? Until then, y'all, I'm Alicia. Don't forget to thumbs up this video, comment below, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.